So uh, in some in some ways, working on this painting was um, a little bit of a guilty pleasure uh, because I was working on things for the Conference on World Affairs, but I was also getting to do um, my own thing as well. Uh, no, no restrictions were really placed on me, so um, I took advantage of as much of that as, as I could. Uh, one of the things that I do um, in all my paintings that I enjoy is working with uh, ballpoint pens. Um, in the beginning of my career, I used to always work with stolen pens, and um, not that it's a big deal to steal them, but uh, they represent a free artist material, and I love the accessibility of that medium. Um, I, to this day, I still don't know how archival it is. I've done a lot of research with no results, so I just have determined that it's worth it to me. Um, and so all you can see, all this area, is a lot. this painting has a lot of detail in it, um, a lot of ballpoint pen, and it has some specific details that I personally am very interested in. Um, one of them is honeycomb and bees, uh, which relate to food, uh, and it's a, a personal interest of mine. I'm, I'm very, very um, interested in the health of, of bees, especially native bees. Uh, and one of the things I wanted to incorporate into the painting was um, a, a, something about space travel, because space travel is often a big part of, or, or a, a line of the uh, item of the, of the Conference on World Affairs. And um, while I was working on the painting, um, I might have even been drinking a little beer, I can't remember. Uh, I was thinking about space travel and I had kind of an epiphany and uh, the, I wrote a quote on here and then I felt kind of bad about it because it wasn't part of the agenda. Um, however, it was part of my agenda and it says, um, it says, Dear Sir, this is space travel. When you look out, do you see anything else? Uh, don't you think that we should steward the ship? And my point being that we discuss space travel a lot, but we often uh, we forget that we're the only thing within millions of miles uh, out in space traveling. And, and it's crazy to me that you wouldn't treat a spaceship like this if you thought of it as a spaceship, the way we, we treat the planet. Um, so I suppose that's my little political statement that I stuck in there, which is I, I hope that we will all come to the point of treating the planet with a lot, with the same respect that we would air. Uh, we can't survive without it. So, yeah.